I got my dishwasher finally. Look at that fancy shirt. You guys gotta check out this necklace. But we're gonna be hitting day three on this wall. You are well, chewing on my pants. Oh my goodness, you're sassy. That's the back of my couch. I know. So it has been a busy start to our Memorial Day already. Aspen, I told you, had kind of a stomach bug going on last night. And he has had, I had to give him a sitz bath already this morning. Because that poor guy, his little bottom is so sore, he's walking bow legged. He's walking like Duke was after his surgery. I feel so bad for him. But I've been telling you guys that I've been doing so much work outside. It's been kind of creating, getting crazy inside. So... I did something, you guys, and I don't know if you've ever heard of it, but it's called Fly Lady. And I followed her program on and off for several years. And when I follow her program, things go so smoothly in my house because it's designed, if you're busy, to be able to get things done and to just form a routine. So what I decided to do today, because I still need to work on the wall, is do a little bit of the inside work this morning get that stuff done, and then go outside and work. Even if I don't get everything accomplished that I wanted to get accomplished in the house today, every little bit helps, and it's not getting so far behind. So this morning we did a lot of pickup in the living room and dining room areas. I've got a load of dishes started, and yes, you guys, or I'm getting ready to start them. I've got a load of laundry going. I got my dishwasher finally. So there it is. It's not, oh wait, can you see it? Wait, no, you can't see it. There it is, it's not beautiful, it's used. But it cost me 40 bucks and it's portable. I didn't have to worry about having an electrician come hook anything up. I can just pull it up to the sink, load it, start it, roll it over after I've unloaded it. So that's really nice. It's really nice to have that luxury that I haven't had in a very long time. And I tell you what, I don't have dishes piling up everywhere. We've been doing a little bit of catch up because I told you I've been busy outside and we've just been running back and forth. But having the dishwasher has been so nice because I can throw them in there. Forget about it, unload it later. So that's how our morning's going. Happy Memorial Day, Ireland. <laughs> She's like, Mommy, I just want to chill. Can I watch Moana? Can you watch Moana? Yeah, we rented Moana, you guys. My all time favorite Disney movie so far that they've ever made. Love that movie. Little Mermaid's always been my favorite, and, and it's still one of my favorites, but Moana. Just a beautiful movie. So if you haven't seen it, it's definitely worth seeing. Matt watched it. We all watched it as a family movie night. And Matt's like, yeah, definitely my favorite Disney so here's movie. Here's our back. Memorial Day crowd, guys. Tina and Heath came by. My mom and dad. Look at that fancy shirt. You guys got to check out this necklace. I don't know if the camera will pick it up. Check that out. It's like it's like an optical illusion. It'll mess with your eyes. How's your dinner? So we're having... Grandma brought watermelon. I can't show. Yeah, that's good stuff. Watermelon. And she brought this salad I haven't tried yet, but it looks really good. Some baked beans, chips, and look at this. What'd you make, baby? This is smoked pork tenderloin. And you have what? A chipotle one and then one that's just salt and pepper seasoned? Yes. So all of our yummy. company has left, but do you guys know what this is? This is my dishwasher full of clean dishes. That I didn't have to do myself. I'm so excited for this. I want it again today, but we're gonna be hitting day three on this wall. See if I can't get this one finished and then maybe tomorrow we can get started. No, tomorrow we have a doctor's appointment. So we won't be doing any on that wall tomorrow. So hopefully the day after I'll be able to get this, this side started.
nearly finished you guys. I still have the iris flower box to make, but look at that. It's done. So all I have left is to line this and I'm going to do it the same way I'm doing this one and then line through here and I can start digging up, putting the irises in and then our hostas and flowers in here. So yeah, the first part of the retaining sidewalk, I don't know what you want to call it, sidewalk border is done and I think it looks really nice. I can't wait to start putting the flowers in. And then we're off to this side. Oh yeah, that looks a hundred times better. Look at that difference. That's amazing. Oh no, you have Zane's puppy. Oh yeah, he wanted water. Oh, hi buddy. Hi, buddy. You are too. You can't do what it. are you two doing over here? Pokemon. Who's winning? I'm I'm releasing the bird. You see the only bird around here. Release the Kraken. Oh, that was one of the strongest Pokemon. <laughs> so who's winning? You killed another one of me. Are you going to grab a card? There's your baby. Hi, Masha. She's so sweet. Hi, Masha. Whoa! Well, it's done. Aspen's eating a snack. What are you having? Um, these and these. Yeah, are you eating beans and cottage cheese? Yeah. Miss Ireland, can you pick up the stuff that was in your bucket, your toy bucket? There's a baby. What in the world? There's a baby and a blanket. And those are my gloves you used the other day. You are chewing on my pants. Oh my goodness, you're sassy. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Duke is not so much. He's a puppy still, but he's not that much of a puppy anymore. That's so funny. Anyway, while the kids are taking care of you, their chores, what are you doing? Are you playing toys? You coming away from me. I took them. What did I take away from you? Not Pokemon. The card shuffler? No. Yeah, you have a toy you're playing with. Do you do you want your food moved closer to you so it's not getting all over your train track? Here. Let's move it over here. There you go. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get to putting away a load of laundry, and uh, then we'll see how the rest of the Do you have a fidget spinner? Yeah. Whose fidget spinner is that, Sky? Mine. Dad surprise you tonight? Yeah. 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 Let me see. see it. Yeah, that's the kind he wanted, you guys, was that butterfly spinner, right? Yep. Let me see it. You're just fascinated by those fidget spinners, aren't you? Let me look. All right, so update, guys. Look at him. He is doing beautiful, aren't you? Hey, big boy. Dookie. Hey, Dookie. Let me what are you doing? Out. What are you doing? <laughs> look at you. Look at you. Say hi, everybody. I feel good. Yeah, What's that. wrong? Why are you crying? What's wrong? I want that spinner fly. You want that spinner fly? <laughs> oh, you guys, look at this. He does not feel good. He's running a fever. He's had diarrhea for two days. You've been sick, huh? Yeah, you just don't feel good. You need to go no night. You ready to go no night? No. No. You never ready to go no Remember I told you about those crazy, hold on, my TV is ridiculously loud. Remember I told you about those uh, moments that we have sometimes having a three-year-old in the house, especially a determined three-year-old? So Aspen has had a really sore bottom, and I've been having him air it out, keep a diaper off. We've been using the potty, trying to keep his bottom from getting any more of a tomato look than it already has. And I had a diaper sitting on the coffee table waiting for him to go to bed and the medicine for his bottom that my neighbor gave me. Really cool stuff. Nice full jar of it. So he was quietly sitting on the couch. Matt and T were talking to each other. I was talking to my mother-in-law on the phone in the kitchen, putting dishes in the dishwasher. And Matt turns and looks, and yep, you see it, that's the back of my couch. So, 
I did it. I use this really awesome product and we're gonna see just how well it works to get this out. So I'll show you guys the finished product when I'm done, but let's look at it again. Isn't that nice, you guys? That's lovely, huh? Yeah, Duke likes it too. Mm -hmm. So let's see, I'm gonna give you a close up on it. Oh, hush your face over there. What are you barking at? Yeah, that's how bad it is. It is, mm-hmm. It's funny, thick on there, and it has but, Vaseline in it. So. A funny face on the couch. Okay, so the first step that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some soap and some water and try to cut through the Vaseline. Then I'm gonna use this stuff. This is Woolite Carpet and Upholstery. Now this has worked wonders on my furniture every time before. Let's see if it does it this time. All right, so I've got my hot soapy water here and I just have Dawn Platinum Protection in this. This is gonna be our first step. minutes into cleaning this petroleum jelly or Vaseline based skin cream off the couch and I can still feel it in there so I'm going to show you one of the most important parts of getting rid of this a butter knife and you literally have to scrape it yep scrape it out of the couch like that and then wipe it onto your rag mm -hmm. Nice, huh? So, I don't know, I'm about 45 minutes to an hour in. Athens watching Jay House. So you remember this handy little scrubber I got the other day? It dispenses soap really slowly. So what are you doing? <laughs> I was I thought he was snapping at me, snapping at the dog. I don't know what he's doing. Duke's like, what are you doing? Anyway, I'm gonna use this because it just dispenses a little bit of soap at a time. And I don't want to drown my couch in soap. So, next up, yeah. 45 minutes to an hour. I Googled in. this, and that's how I found out about scraping it. And then cornstarch. That's what we're going to put on next. This needs to sit for an hour. So, let's see. Wait about an hour for that cornstarch to set in. And I have just a couple of pans that aren't going to fit in my dishwasher. Like this one is huge. There's one left over, so I'm just going to hand wash that. And a couple of the big pots, these ones won't fit in the dishwasher either. So I'm gonna wash those up and get this kitchen in shape. I'm loving it. I'm gonna start this dishwasher as soon as I'm done. And then we'll go back in and see if this trick works. Hey, right, you know what that is, right? The beautiful sound to me. Look at that. This is all I had to hand wash today. Some of the big pots and pans. Some of our grilling stuff, knives. I don't like to put those in the dishwasher because I've had one of my kids actually open up the dishwasher when they were little and pull them out. And we were lucky. It did not end up being a bad thing. So knives will be hand washed in this house. But yeah, look at that. That is a beautiful sight. The end of the night in the kitchen is clean. I can tell and I almost forgot to pick up the camera and film this. Anyway, I'm not sure it's dry enough to do it yet because I had some moisture on the couch. But you're supposed to brush this cornstarch off after it's dry and it's supposed to lift it. So I'm going to brush some of it off and see how it looks. And then I'm probably going to let it dry overnight and then brush it again. Maybe add some more cornstarch tomorrow and vacuum it. So we'll see what the look is like and if I actually got all this stuff out sometime tomorrow.